So we started out uh, in 2012. I was doing music before and uh, I had met Lauren and her background is visual art and so I had asked her to design an album cover for the record I was working on. Then I overheard her singing and was amazed and I said, hey, would you be interested in singing on one of the songs? And that's when Lowland Hum started. A few years later, we were offered a residency in Charlottesville. We just loved it. So we extended our lease for another year and then another year and then another year. And we just knew we wanted to base our operation here. One thing that makes Charlottesville unique is um, a spirit of collaboration. There are so many different people here thinking about different things, working um, in different disciplines, really excellent work in, in different areas, and there is a lot of cross-pollination and a lot of communication. We feel really um, like it's been a gift to be folded into that community of, of collaboration. The support of our community is so important because without that support, uh, there's this feeling of being alone and trying to tackle what two people can't tackle alone. It's a pretty isolating lifestyle if, you, if you're a touring musician, a touring artist, and even any kind of art is, is often created in isolation. Um, and it's really important to have other voices in your life and to have the support of people that you know love you and support what you're, what you're making and just you as an individual. And I think we've really found that here in Charlottesville. We were very surprised and encouraged that, uh, that a, a company like US Cellular, that size company, would take an interest in a band as small as our band. A gift of touring is getting to see on the ground level like a bunch of beautiful things that are happening in different places. And I think it's exciting to me that a, that a company like US Cellular would um, want to highlight things that are happening locally. Spread.